Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We are here and we're hot. We got some stuff to say. We got some stuff to say. If you are not a grown person, you might want to turn this off right now because your feelings is about to get hurt. Because once again, once again, my friends, the crybabies. The crybabies have returned. They're mad. They're upset because they believe that somehow they deserve compensation for something that they didn't earn. They didn't work for it. But they believe somehow that they deserve it. Just like this little baby. All they know about is themselves. All they know about is what they personally need. Their immediate food and shelter needs and they're crying and they want somebody to carry them through life they want somebody to take them through life they think that the world owes them a living and these kind of people have existed in every culture in every society since humans began and it's garbage and it's trash and if you go along with it you're a baby so we're here talking to the people that is men we're here talking to the people that is women we're here talking to people that are adults that recognize that if you want something out of life, if you need something out of life, you got to go get it. It's not owed to you. Nobody owes you nothing. Most of us understand that a real man, a real woman, an adult is going to lead by example. They're going to lead by example and show you that hard work, resiliency of mind, of body, of spirit is what is necessary to get things done in life. Gideon, this is just Marvel Strike Force. It's a video game. Why are you getting so mad? Have you not heard the phrase, he who is faithful in that which is least is faithful in that which is much? Have you not heard that before? Right? Don't Do we not tell our children just because you can doesn't mean you should. You don't want to teach people to take shortcuts because it messes things up for other people. A baby can only see what's in front of them. An adult recognizes that their actions, their decisions affect not just themselves, but they affect the world around them. They affect not just their present, but it also affects their future. That's why you have to learn how to work hard. You have to be able to accept defeat and push forward. You don't just get to have stuff for free. Now, why are we talking about this in the first place? Well, many of you, you probably know why. But for those who don't, let's fill you in. This is the Incursion Invaders event. They are rerunning it. They're rerunning it because, as they promised, they promised they would. They're doing it because the first time, after one of the updates, there was a mistake. There was a bug. You see the bonus room there, the bonus room on the right? It says it requires invaders at gear tier 15 five stars okay that was a requirement invaders gear tier 15 five stars here's my invaders we got him at gear tier 16 that's good that meets the qualifications however however i do not have five stars on the majority of the roster i don't have the five stars therefore i do not qualify i do not qualify i did not and i was not able to to go into that section and compete for those rewards and grab those rewards because my team does not qualify. I did not put in the time. I did not put in the money in this case to do so. And oh yes, that's what we're talking about. There was money involved. If you did not put in the money, you don't deserve it. So this is the rewards that are inside, right? You can check and see the rewards. What do we see? We see orange gear. All right, they got orange gear in there. There's some teal gear. There's some teal gear, some teal gear orbs. Good, good. And then up there in the upper left-hand corner, what do you see? Blue ISO number five. Blue ISO number five that generally speaking is not for sale. It's only the result of specialized events where usually people have to spend money, right? I did not have the characters to come in here. So I did not come in here because I don't deserve it. I do not meet the qualifications. For me to do so will take some more work, time, and effort. It is what it is. It's not for me. I do not deserve it. I did not earn it. But because of a bug, it was allowing people in. It was allowing people in who did not meet the requirements. So people came in here and got the stuff. They closed down the event and they said they would send out compensation. So many of us got this mail couple days ago right we got this mail and it had some stuff in it whatever it is there's some some orange gear 
there's some teal gear items awesome some teal gear pieces good good there's some teal orbs outstanding outstanding but you know what else was in that room blue iso 5 and it's not here it's not here in the compensation package and people are upset people are angry and we shouldn't be we shouldn't be man we shouldn't be stuff like this is game like like you guys are just interested in you you're just interested in you you sit here and you complain about scopely but you're just interested in you so we walk around with this mentality that somehow we're owed something nobody owes you nothing no one owes you jack they don't they don't people think they are owed a living in this day and age and they're lazy and they just want somebody to give stuff to them and it's garbage did you wake up this morning did you wake up this morning amen to that man amen to that you have another day in front of you go get it man as they say seize the day seize the day no one owes you nothing greatness is earned it's not given and the rent is due every day baby these are not my words these are the words of somebody i look up to but it's real and we saw again we're saying gideon why are you getting so mad it's just a game it's not it art imitates life this is a reflection of culture this is a reflection of society right these are the same cats that walk around trying garage doors that walk around trying your car doors that walk around looking for excuses to steal from you well he left it sitting there well he left it out he didn't lock his door he wasn't looking there, nobody said no nobody said i couldn't that's the world that we live in today and that's what this is it's a mindset correct your mindset if you'll do it here in this little thing you will do it in bigger things in life man that's how it goes that's how it goes. So if you can tell from the picture, I don't know if you can or not, it's a pair of pants. Nobody's in them. You look at the top, they're not attached to a person. It's just a pair of pants with some money in it. Right? That's your money. But because you forgot to take it out and you sent your pants to the dry cleaners or you told your children to wash that load of laundry with your pants in it or you asked the maid to wash that load of laundry with your pants in it or you have a cleaning company and you said you were going to do these people's laundry and one of your employees sees that there's money in this pants that means they can take it right that means they can take it the door's open guys the door's open it's free money grandma left her phone open it's free money we can get stuff on amazon it's okay she didn't say no she didn't say no guys it's okay it's okay no i didn't ask her but she didn't say no so it's okay no we both know that that's wrong and that's incorrect and that is stealing and as it is in this case as well how did most of us even know that this was happening right i didn't know it was happening so how did people know well you probably got notified somehow you probably got notified on discord you probably got notified via twitter reddit maybe you remember you were live on twitch and you got notified right some some social media blast some information blast told people hey man the door is open they didn't lock the door they didn't lock the door it's not stealing it's not stealing they didn't lock it you know it was wrong they know it was wrong they did it it's just like those guys who run into the store a bunch of people they can't stop all of us they just got this guy at the door he doesn't even have a firearm we'll, we'll just all run into the apple store and grab stuff right they can't stop us all right that's just the same mentality it's the same attitude and it's wrong let me give you another for instance here's an illustration we got little timmy here little timmy i told him i told little timmy he could not have any of those cookies i told him he could not have the cookies right the kids are over they're playing they're doing what they're supposed to be doing we're having fun hide and seek whatever you want to do he's not supposed to be having cookies we're outside playing kickball he's not supposed to be having cookies we can't find little timmy we're outside playing kickball where's timmy look around for him look around for him in the backyard come in the house and here's timmy and a couple of his buddies eating my cookies eating my cookies that i told him that he couldn't have or even if i didn't tell him those cookies were for my wife they're for a special occasion 10 year wedding anniversary right there was this lady who made us these cookies when we got married and we tracked her down we found her 10 year wedding anniversary she made more of the cookies for us are special they're expensive they're priceless in some sense of the word and here's timmy eating my cookies so what are you supposed to do what do you do do you call all the kids in and say guys Timmy got in the cookies and he wasn't supposed to. These cookies are special. They're supposed to be for my wife. They're supposed to be for a special occasion. 
But because Timmy got into the cookies, we're going to make it right. We're going to make it right for everybody. Cookies for everybody. Compensation. No. No. You don't do that. You don't do that. What's more reasonable is there is some discipline that is going to be meted out. Right? He's got to know that it was wrong. He's got to know that he made a mistake and it was wrong. Ain't no ifs, ands, or buts about it. It's wrong. Right? And I guarantee you right now. I guarantee you right now. My kids, right? When I got a phone call like that, because people do stuff they shouldn't do. We get it to an extent. We get it to an extent. So that's why when I got a phone call, my kids was acting up like that. Oh, they know what's up. They know what's up. Because you can't teach them to be taking shortcuts in life. You can't teach them that anybody, the people owe them stuff. That everything is just theirs for the taking. That's not what it is. That's not what it is. So how about this? Right? All you guys that are talking all this stuff, let's flip the script. Scopely, why don't you ban these cats? Why don't you give them a week off for the game? Give them a week off for the game. I bet you it stops happening. I bet you it stops happening. Give them a week off for the game. If they quit, so what? So what? They're cheaters. They're cheaters and they know it. They know it. They're cheating. And cheating's bad for the game. It's cheating. Right? We think we're not hurting anybody, but we are. Man, we've been playing this game for five years. Do you not understand how this works? You're not getting over on anybody. There is a cadence to the in-game economy. There is a calendar somebody brought out, okay? And they're like, all right, this is when the blue ISO 5 is supposed to be introduced into the game. And, and this is where it gets introduced uh, more of a free-to-play avenue and We'll say that that date, let's say it was November. November, we're gonna start putting it into the game a little bit more free to play, right? Let's just pretend, we're just pulling that out of our, our cheekbones. But now, all that happens is they're gonna give you the compensation and then they're gonna say, well, this was about six months. This was about six months of uh, ISO development. So we're gonna push that back to like uh, May of next year, June, July, somewhere. Well, we have to push it back. That's all that happens. That's all that happens. You think you're getting over because you're like that little baby and you want it right now. But an adult knows it's damaging the growth down the line because that's what's happening. It's damaging the growth down the line because people cheated. All it does is make it so these guys here that's at the bottom of your roster, it's going to be longer to bring them up. All it's going to mean is that your Nova, all it's going to mean is your Nova is going to take longer to get to ISO 5. That's all that means. You think you're getting over on somebody, but you're not. And we say, well, well, the gap between it's it's extending the gap between the pay and, and the free community. No, you're extending the gap because you pushed it back. So that's six more months. That's six more months of cats putting power into their Nova. That's six more months of cats putting power into their Kang. That's six more months of cats putting power into their Red Hulk. That's six more months of people putting power into whatever the next meta character is that you don't get you're widening the gap you're widening the gap because you're a cheater here's the top of my roster right so here we're close we're close on archangel that's getting pushed back right that's all that's going to happen it's getting pushed back your big dog apocalypse is getting pushed back that's all that's happening man and gear tier 18 is coming up so I mean, maybe you could have got a little bit more power, but all you're doing is allowing the biggest of the big to have more time, more time without you being able to make a move. That's all it is. That's all it is. Me, bring it on. I know that you got to work for stuff in life, man. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. I know you got to work for stuff in life. So I would like to hear your thoughts in the comments. No crybaby nonsense. No crybaby nonsense. But if you're a man, woman, an adult, do you have a solution? Do you have a suggestion? Do you have something that could be used to assist in the process right we've heard some good ones there's actually some good ones online there are there's some good suggestions out there right but if your answer includes the word scopely sucks it's not a good answer right because it's about you what are you going to bring to the situation what are you going to bring what's the solution from the perspective of an adult from a man a woman an adult somebody who knows how to get something done i would love to hear your comments Okay, and this is one of those times in life that if you're reaching out for something 
If you're reaching out for a goal, if you're reaching out for a dream, I want to hear about that too. I want to know what you are putting into practice to make sure your dream becomes reality. Get that. Peace.